at the equation. The equation. The equation is integration can be defined. Integration can be defined. Integration can be defined as the reverse of differentiation. Integration is simply the reverse of differentiation. Um, are you all well, familiar with the equation very right? Yes, sir. Which last class, the position, right? I'm going to show you how to So let's say, look at this. Let me just broach the idea of position here. So let's say that I have that y should be equal to x to the power n. I'm fine with the same method. I have y here and x. So let me pass over there. The y over the x has been equal to, we said for differentiation, the rate that multiplied by the power and subtract 1, right? So I'll have that, that becomes n times x to the power n minus 1. Combine these two, the y over the x is equal in value to n x to the power n minus 1. This becomes the concept of differentiation. Let me do integration. Let's say that I'm given that the y over the x is equal to x to the power n. This is for integration. Let's do a different this. What's the first tax? I'll take the x here. So I'll let it what? The y to be equal to x to the power n dx. True or false? True. At this point now, I will integrate through. So in the Rating true. What do I get? By the way, integration is abbreviated using the symbol integral. This becomes integral, a symbol for representing the integration. So we take integrate to integrate true. I'll have that the integral of dy is equal to the integral of what? x to the power n dx. I'm here. Not so at this point. Note that if I have Integral of dx or integral of dy. Here is like that. If I integrate dx, I'll have x. Similarly, if I integrate the y, I'll have what the y. What's the concept? Integral and d cancels out. Let's what this x. Integral and d cancels out y. So note that if I integrate the x, I'll have x. Similarly, if I integrate the y, I'll have y. What does this mean? It means that if I integrate the y, all I have here, y, y. I that y is y equal to x. integrate x to power n. This is not whole, it's not. Here's the idea of integration. For differentiation, what do we do? Multiply by the power of b yes. and subtract from b. Yes. For this one, you will work there. This box you add 1 to the power. Instead of subtracting, you what? You right. add 1. Look up. That becomes this x now, n to power 1 plus n plus 1, you can see that now, all about what? n plus 1. Let's go, plus c. This is not. As to oppose this subtraction, I what? I will add. To oppose the multiplication, I what? I will divide. So when it comes to integration, the idea is that I'm adding one to the power. Whatever I have in the power, I will put it down. Then plus c. Plus c here is called the constant of integration. I'll take you through some examples. You understand better. This was a uh, this was a representative. I'm trying to just illustrate how integration works. Let's call the method of solving integration. Then look at how to apply them to solve problems. Let's call the method of integration. There are about three distinct important methods when it comes to integration. Number one, they call the substitution method. Number one is called Sorry, 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 sorry. General method. General methods. Let's have it up. General method. Number two is called the substitution method. And number three there, we have the integration by parts. We have um, Integration um, by part. So let's call this method one after the 
order. Let's have the first one called the real record. General method. Alright, let's start this one, please. Look up, please. Look up, look up. Let me emphasize the short to this. Okay, let's do some example and further explain the concept behind the general method of integration. Example one. Example one. Integrate the following. Number one. Let's say I have number one. Example one to be equal to the integral into. 3x squared plus, sorry, 3x cubed plus 4x squared minus 3x with respect to the x. Let's take this example 1 and solve together. Of course, you can apply differentiation here. Why? Because I'm seeing integral symbol becomes what? An integration. That's the it. How do you identify the integration question when you see the symbol integral becomes what? Integration question. I will solve this one here. So I will apply the concept of general method to solve this. How? Listen up. I will multiply the integral symbol by the first term here and attach the x to it. Similarly, I will use integral symbol to multiply 4x squared and attach what? The yeah. x to it. Finally, I will multiply the integral symbol with what? 3x and what? Attach the x to it. So let's do that this. I will be having the integral first. What is the first term here? 3x squared. Attach the x to it and done. 3x cubed. Alright, 3x cubed. So attach the x to it and done. So plus integral symbol. Next up, 4x squared. Attach the x to it minus, minus the integral symbol. Attach what then? 3x the x to it. It becomes your first step here. Very simple, very easy. Use the integral symbol to expand and attach what? the x to each of them. At this point, take your constant term outside the integral sign. When I say constant term, those are what? Number alone, right? From here now, I'm seeing 3 is a number. I'm seeing 4 a number. 3, 2 a number. They are constant. You take them outside what there? The integral sign. So I'll have 3 first. Next up, integral what? S Q the x. Take it outside. Next up, plus this is a 4, constant there. 4 integral what there? X squared dx. Similarly, minus 3 integral what there? X dx. And here. How do we integrate this one here? How do we integrate x cubed dx? This is 3. I will have 3. Open bracket. Integrate x cubed. All I have. That's because what? x cubed plus 1 all over what? 3 plus 1. You said there is add 1 to the power. But the way I have the power, you put it down. That's the concept. Add 1 to 3. That's what 3 plus 1. But the way I have it here, you put it down. That's what. So I have the integrated what? x cubed dx. I'm done with this. Plus, plus, 4 into integrate x squared. All I have. x squared plus 1 all over what? 2 plus 1. Walk. Anyone from here? You proceed. Yes, minus, minus, 3 into integrate x the x. All I have? 1. Integrate uh, the x. All I have? 1. By the way, integrate x. All I have? x 1 plus 1. All I have? 1, one plus 1. True, of course. True. True. Because there's an invisible one here already. So I want the invisible one. I have this one here. Next up. Plus C. After um, integration in each one of them, you always add what? Plus C. Plus C is called constant of integration. If it's not there, you are wrong. I should have plus C is there. At this point, then, what becomes our answer? Um, 3 times S. Okay, for me, I will have 3 into S. Um, S to the power 4. Exactly. I will have S to the power 4 all about what? 4. Next up, plus. 4 into what I have here? S cubed all about what? 3. Am I right? Minus minus 3 into what there? X squared all about 2. Next up, plus C. Plus C. Anyone from here? Anyone from here? Let's proceed. Multiply 3 by this. I will have 3x about 4 all about 4. Plus 4x cubed. 
all over 3 minus what that? 3x squared all over 2 log c. This becomes my answer after integrating this particular question. Any question? Let's copy down, copy down, copy down, copy down. Copy down. Copy with down. Copy down. Copy down. Uh, I'll use this multiply this one here. So I'll have what? 
Even before that, I can see something that can cancel out, right? Four cancel out four and off, right? Two year one, two year three. You know that's implication? No. So I have one year here. One that's x power four is x to power four over what there? Three. Plus minus, right? 
plus minus minus plus. Fix up and multiplication. Exactly. You can, you can apply this method. Now, I can apply this method to this one. What do you say now? Oh, what do you say 2x? Yes. yes. How do you do it? 2x multiplied with 2 x multiplied by 2 x Please, change the rule. Do some conversation rule. Is that how we use for this? It has died. That's the end of conversation. This is a situation rule. Don't, 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 don't combine this concept. Don't miss us. Don't talk. This is not change the rule. This is not map purely situation. Please. Please. Listen up. For this one, how do you solve it? Let's say that some given integral variable cannot be done. You say what? The given integral variable. Hence, you have to what? Change it to what? A suitable one for the integral to be done. What do you do here? Your first task, let you be the thing in brackets. Let you to be equal to what? 4x squared minus 5. It's not. And why? This is not cool. No, there's no why here. So get to the position. Throw it away. This is the division. Huh? And we'll just put this in our first task procedure. Your first task, call it in brackets, call it you. Differentiate you. With what? Respect to x. I'll mark what? U dx. The u over the x has been equal to what? It is. 8x. That's all, right? Yes. Now, this is not good. This is not. I'll make the x subject. I'll make the x subject. How? I will swap this. Other. I will swap the position. Are you there? So I'll have that. Uh, therefore, the x is equal to the u over 8x. Throw across. Swap position. Exactly. The x, you can see the x here now. You now put this two value there. Are you there? So from here now, I'll have that the integral of what? 2x. This one, this is not. We take in brackets. We call it what? u. This thing in brackets, we just say it's what? U. U. Oh, now, okay. At this point now, substituting. Substituting. So I'll have the integral. This is not the integral of 2x. We said this one now is what? U. I'll have dot U. The x. What my the x is? What the x? U. U over 8x. I'll have. The u all over what? 8x. And this one, what next? S cancel out x. True or false? True. 2 here, 1. 2 here, 4. I have 4 left. So I've done all I have my answer there. From here, I will have the integral. This is not good. Integral of what? 1 over 4. I mean, I have a 4 left here. I mean, now. So in the group, it go 1 over 4. I so I'm having 1 over 4 du dot du. Sorry, u dot du. 1 over 4 u dot du. Yes, yeah, it's, it's quite simple. 2 year 1, 2 year 4. That one and 4 is 1 over 4. Yes, bro. Is it confusing? Yes. Is it confusing? Yes. No, sir. Huh? I know that's not true. Why is it for your statement? Well, I have another question. So I'm thinking, go back to the question. Integral, integral. 2x, 2x. This one now, you just said it was u. Who that you get? That, 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 when you do substitute, you are replacing. But I thought I already substituted u. Yes, so now I'm telling 